Hello everyone and welcome back to The Last of Us Remastered on PS4. Okay, we're still playing Grounded difficulty. Um, in the last part we made our way through the, the city quite a bit, making through all the streets, taking out any hunters we could spot, and also trying to evade them as much as we could. And um, we're still making our way towards the bridge to get out the city. But we've got a bit of a problem in front of us here. Just outside this building, you can see through this window, there's a big truck outside on the street. He's got a big turret on top of it, so if he spots us, we've got to be careful not to be standing in the open for too long. And there's also hunters um, stalking around inside this building. So we need to be as quiet as we can for as long as we can, really. Try not to get spotted. Just going to make sure there's no one around any of these corners. Right, we've got a guy actually right up in front of us outside. I think we're going to stay to the outside just so we can um, make a run for it probably a bit easier. There's a pipe on the ground there. I think my one's been used a bit. I know it hasn't. Okay, that doesn't matter. I'll just pick this one up anyway. Doesn't make any difference. So we can take this guy out, it looks like, by sneaking up behind him. He's not moving. Let's just be cool, man. Take him backwards take behind this um, this shelving. So I'm not sure if anyone comes behind us through there, that door, the way we came. I just hope no one does. Fuck. Yeah, fuck indeed, Ellie. So I'm gonna creep on forward a bit more. I think this guy's still inside that store. Now I'm not sure if you can actually stealth all the way through this. I'm not sure if the truck spots you. Maybe depending on which way he's facing, depends on if he'll spot you. That would make sense, but there could be a guy just looking out the front window. So when it looks to the far left again, we'll make a move from this car to that police car. Take it one step at a time. Actually, looking the other way now. So if we actually go behind the police car now. Yeah, that's fine. So we can evade the tank getting across. It's not a tank, is it? It's just a truck. What do you call them? Humvees? Are they Humvees? So we're going to keep on creeping. Get behind this car now. Ooh, that was close. And a full 360 there pretty quick. Okay, so we can get inside this building. Need to get a weapon out really to make sure we don't get spotted. Take anyone out quickly if we um, do get a bit of oh, shit. Why is he moving? Okay, we've got people coming in here now as well. Have they spotted us? Shit, it looks like they're actually coming towards us. They know we're here. For sure. Shit. Okay, things got very scrappy right there. Just need to reload this rifle. I wasn't expecting all that just to happen out of nowhere because I didn't actually get spotted. Guy behind that water container. Took him out nice. The rifle does come in handy. It's very useful because it's obviously one shot kill. Just quickly check these guys, see if you've got anything on them. Okay, so we've got the truck outside now shooting us. So we're gonna switch to a weapon that's got a few more bullets in it. Quickly make quick movement cover to cover. Just get behind this desk. Maybe when he stop when he stops his bear shooting, we'll run backwards in here, jump in here, crouch. Nice. So we got a bit more cover now. We got two rooms between us and the um, the gunner. There he is. Shit. Let's get behind here. We're gonna make our way through this window, get behind the police car, and then we'll make our next move. So we get down here. And we're going to go behind this building. We're going to move from this car to that car before we actually make the full run. So we'll get here. And we're going to make a run to the bin now. We should be clear of the um, the gunner. So we'll make a run. Nice. So we are in the clear for the moment. We've got a guy coming towards us. We've also got a brick. So we're going to use the brick on him. It's quite lucky there that he didn't actually land that punch on us. Okay, we've got another guy up ahead. you just seen him run away in the distance. 
I think the truck can actually still see us. If we move to here. Nice, one shot. We must have shot him earlier to make that a one shot kill. I'm not sure, I don't think the heart is a place you can shoot on, on enemies on this way. It would kill them in one shot. It's like chest is always the. Doesn't matter where about you hit them in the torso. I don't think so anyway. So when he stops shooting, we're gonna make a run. Now. Let's get behind this building. Shit, he's still shooting us. Shit, he followed us! Oh my god! Run! Get in here! I didn't expect him to come through the fence there. I think we are clear of him now though. Let's get the bow and arrow out. Okay, we're gonna go upstairs. This is non-stop. Non-stop getting attacked by hunters. No breathing space. So we fi we've fired um, three rifle rounds in that section and also one revolver. And I don't think we actually did pick up any ammo in between. So I think we're going to have to go out that window there. But before we do that, just quickly have a little scavenge. Yeah, it's all empty in here. Nothing useful. Check this last corner. Yeah, of course, it's empty. So I've got to creep out this window. Tank still. You look, you just drove off. I'm going to creep along this board. This conveniently placed board. And we're going to stand up, I think. Sneak across this um, ledge. There's a window we can jump in here. Jump in. Got some weapon parts on this counter. I love the de the design on these um, buildings as well. Like every room is different. Nothing's copy and pasted. It's all unique, you know. And all, even all the bits on the bed, like everything's like its own place. Move, bitch. Sorry. Check the kitchen. Yeah, it's empty. Right, back out again. Make our way across. We're okay. They can't see us. Just hope he doesn't look up. Jump in this window. Take it easy. It's all right. They're not the bad guys. Lower the gun. Man, you hit hard. Man, well, I was trying to kill you. Yeah, I thought you were one of them, too. Then I saw you. If you haven't noticed, they don't keep kids around. Survival of the fittest. You're bleeding. That's ah, just nothing. I'm Henry. This is Sam. I think I caught your name was Joel. Ellie. How many are with you? They're all dead. Hey, we don't know that. There were a bunch of us. Someone had the brilliant idea of entering the city. Look for supplies. Those fuckers, they ambushed us. <clears throat> Scattered us. Now it's all about getting out of this shithole. We can help each other. Ellie. Safety in numbers and all that. She's right. We could help each other. We got a hideout not too far from here. Be safer if we chat there. All right, take us there. Follow me. Sorry about the whole gun thing. Don't worry. I would have probably done the same thing. Where are you from? All the way from Hartford. Really? I heard some bad stuff going on down there. Yeah, the military thing is gone. Oh, well, yeah. The place probably looks like this by now.
I've really got to go around every six section here and just scavenge what I can. Sorry about that if I'm uh, interrupting the story there. But because of the difficulty... You can't make everything count. Alright, here they are. Gotta be careful. We're right next to one of their lookout areas. So this for the first time in a long time now. We're starting to build up a bit of a group here. More than just two of us. Joel landed quite a few heavy shots there to Henry's head. <laughs> just dropping bombs on him. Alright, we've got a door here. It's a shiv door. I can't make any shivs, so let's just um, leave that. So Henry seems to know this area quite a bit, so we're gonna let him lead. Wait, wait. Everyone be quiet. Get away from the windows. They're gone. Man, that fucking truck. It's been hounding us ever since we got in this damn Sam, what are you doing? Nothing. Get rid of it. My backpack is practically empty. What's the rule about taking stuff? It weighs like nothing. The rule? What is it? We only take what we have to. That's right. Now come on. Mm -hmm. No time to be a kid in this world. Where is this place? We're close. Real close. Get some Jack and Daxter board games there. Uncharted board game. Where's the toy gone that Sam just dropped? Because I know that Ellie picks it up when you turn your back. She must have already picked it up. I missed it. Oh well. Right, let's continue. Lead the way, Sam. Not Sam. What's his name? Henry. That's it. Shit. What'd you find? Ellie, no. you watch her back. Of course. Sam, stay with her. Okay. Where are the others? So Joel's actually telling Ellie, giving her a responsibility there, watch our back. He's not just telling her to hide. She's part of like the team between them two. Okay, so we have got hunt hunters guarding this area. There's one, two, there's three. There's three, three, three I can see so far. This guy comes closer, we'll grab him. He's turning his back now. Where's the guy on the left gone? Shit. I'm gonna follow this guy into here. Shit. I had to do that. So this went quite messy. So we're empty on that gun now. We managed to take out. We did it. Not bad, old timer. So we sacrificed two um, revolver rounds there. Didn't lose any health, which is the important part. And they didn't drop any ammo either. Up on this truck. So of course now we are very low on ammo. We've actually got some shotgun shells. Make sure they're loaded. They are. Got to keep out the rifle though for the moment. The shotgun's really for close quarters and see and as we are outdoors, you know, across rooftops, we're probably going to need the long range weapon before the shotgun. Okay, so we've got some more guys coming in here. There's two more posted up, they know we're here. So we've got to take these guys out quick. We've got a rifle and a pistol. I'm going to keep the pistol um, ammo up as long as I can, just so if I do have to take a human shield, I can still um, shoot someone, because that's what you can only use pistols in those in situations. So let's, um, they haven't spotted, they haven't actually spotted us yet, they're just guarding, so 
I've got a free shot for the first like few seconds as soon as I stand up. So I'm going to take the guy out. Actually, take the guy on the left first because he looks like a trickier shot. Just make sure where my, where my aiming circle is. There it is. Okay. Took that guy out. Let's make. No, I'm going to save the bow and arrow for stealth situations. Okay, so it's a choice now between the pistol and the shotgun. I'm gonna, I might walk forward, get closer, and just shotgun him in the face. Or even get close enough so we can melee him. He's not popping his head up, so it's not an option to kill him from here. Unless we throw a Molotov. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna spin. Oh shit! Got a quick shot on him. So, um. Yeah, shit, he's died there, isn't he? Maybe if I just jump up quickly. Here he is. Shit! Still alive! Seriously? He's dropped down. Where's he gone? Joel, help me with this, thing. <laughs> this is crazy. So we killed him, kicked him off the roof. Did he go all the way down to the bottom? I don't even see where he's gone. So that was very messy. I thought did not go planned at all. I got shot, so I've took some damage. Wasted two shotgun shells. Uh, very scrappy. That guy's face is destroyed. So the first guy we killed pretty successfully. Second one was pretty messy. You sure it's safe being so close to them? I'm the only one with the key, man. And where'd you get that? So we've actually got no health packs either to band the drop. Just want to quickly search if there's any health bars we can pick up. Fourteen. How old are you? Uh, the same. Oh, you're fourteen, huh? I'm close. <laughs> All right. I am. Pretty desperate now to find some health. We're quickly checking the little food area. Just like looks like there's some pills on the table. That's for your attributes. I wonder if um, if I use the pills to increase my maximum health, it actually heals me as well. So how far away am I? I need 30 more pills to increase my maximum health. Here we are. Welcome to my office. How long have you guys been holed up in here? A few days. We found a bit of food though. Here. Blueberries. Found a whole stash of them. You want some? No. Oh. Hey man, relax. We're safe. So why haven't you left? Been waiting for the right opportunity. And? Here. Check this out. Look at these sons of bitches. Every day they congregate down there, guarding that damn bridge. Come nighttime, it's down to a skeleton crew. After sunset, that's our window. Most of them gone, sneak right past them. That could work. No, it'll work. It'll definitely work. <laughs> wow. Oh Alright, ready? Oh. Ow! <laughs> a blueberry hurt you? It's been a while since that boy even cracked a smile. She doesn't seem bothered by all this. So where were you heading? Heard the Fireflies are based out west somewhere. We're gonna join up with them. Something funny? Oh, it just seems like there's a lot of people putting their stock on the Fireflies these days. Yeah, maybe there's a reason for that. So you don't know where they are, and you're just gonna drag him across the country to find him? I tell you what, how about I worry about my brother, you worry about your girl. Easy. We're looking for the fireflies, too. <sighs> this is us. There's an abandoned military radio station just outside the city. 
Any survivors from our group, they're supposed to meet us there. Tomorrow. You and your girl, you won't join us. It goes down tonight. I guess we best rest up then. He says it's time to go. Now we're gonna be moving fast, okay? So no matter what, you stick to me like glue. Like glue. Like glue. Got it. Good. Good. All right. Y'all ready? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> 